Good morning, afternoon, evening, wherever Good morning. you are. Morning. Morning. I think it's I think it's morning for most for the four of us here. It's morning. <laughs> <laughs> Not all I got to say about it. It's morning. It's morning. It's definitely morning. At least it's not um, Wednesday morning. That's right. Number two, right here. Uh huh. Got I'm, getting, a, I'm getting my caffeine from a soda right now. Uh, you got me for an hour. I have to leave in a, exactly an hour. So, so we have no, no time to wait. That's right. I'll say goodbye. I thought we were going to hang out and talk all day, Pip. Oh, I know. I wish I could, Bags, because I enjoy talking all whole week with you. <laughs> I don't even know what to talk to you about that. Yeah, I was the uh, Azure. Well, Azure wasn't in yet. So I was just sitting here, and the Mags and Pip were just talking about like, North Carolina stuff, and I was just off, you know, doing my own thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, that's funny. <sighs> so, so we have Mindy, and we have Tommy, Chris, um, Jory, who's from South Africa, so it's afternoon for, for her. And then we have Hillary, so it's afternoon for her as well, because she's hey, over Hillary. there on the on the uh, across across the pond, Hi, Hillary in Wales. Mm -hmm. Oh, which pip? Which which pip did you decide on? Which kilt did you decide oh, on? Well, I brought them all so I could show you, but I'm wearing Macbeth today. <laughs> nice. This is, uh -huh. this is my baby family. Nice. Well, your baby's an accept of um, Macbeth. I've got a bunch of others that I want to just show you if I have time, and I'll show you real quick. Before you get started, this is my original kilt. This is McNeil. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's 30 years old. Oh, pretty. Yeah. He has it dust covered, even. Oh, that <laughs> one, yeah, because it's wool. <laughs> and for Mags, I have my German heritage kilt. Yeah, for her German heritage there. Nice. Yeah. And this is for my wife and I both, my Patterson Blue. Nice. Yeah. I love that wow. one. Wow. So Cool. This one is this is McNeil too, but it's McNeil modern. It's a brighter, a little bit brighter you colors. You don't have a Campbell. What's up with that? <sighs> because we follow the McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> when Co, remember? Yeah. There's uh Celtic Nations that has these the uh colors of the seven flags of the seven Celtic nations in it. And the last one. Is Robertson because I have three separate reed lines and reed is a set of, of, uh, of Robertson. So that's my Robertson kilt. I have three reeds. They're not related to each other that I know hey. of. Anyway, there you go. Hey, Lesh. Hey, Karen. And Kay. Very cool, Pip. And there's Kelly. Hey, Mindy. I don't think I've ever seen as many kilts in one place at one time. <laughs> well, I've got I got a couple more on the way, but I'm not saying it real loud because um, the, the spousal unit will be upset, or the or the, they might be delayed in the mail. I don't know what's the. <laughs> So you'll have 10 all together once you get the new one? <laughs> well, it, it's 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 all fun. Hey, uh, Azure, I have to ask this. I've already, I already know your answer. Okay. Though, and I'm going to ask this. So what was your favorite discovery that you made in your research? WikiTree. <laughs> Yay! The question of the week. I I was I would it was a fun question of the week. It was. It was. And Pip, I think Pip answered everybody's question, everybody's answer. He made a comment which was great. Oh, a bunch of them were just fabulous stories. They really were. Yeah, they were. They were. And one and, of them had the ancestor from Gettysburg who was uh remembers the candidate on the third day before before Pickett's charge. And my I had two uncles who were in uh, uh, North Carolina Battery that was participating, shooting those cannonballs at her ancestor. Yes, yes. There were lots and lots and lots of great answers. Um, 
there were a few and, and Pip really loved the romantic ones. Um, oh. I'm going to share my screen here. Let's get that going. <clears throat> Woo! There we go. Woo! Ooh, All right. Right. Tunnel, tunnel of death. Tunnel of death. Yeah. Um, <laughs> there were there were lots of really great great things, and I kind of grouped them all together into people had connections to historical events, like what Pip just told us about the uh, third day of of Gettysburg. Um, a lot of people talked about finding close family, like. We have some people who said that they found their brother or their half brother. Oh. Mm -hmm. um, there were lots of romantic tales, which Pip seems to really like. Um, he would be one of those. Do you do you watch lots of movies with you like girl movies, <laughs> <laughs> romantic like, comedy, rom coms, girl movies? Yeah, I do. I you're, really, the, you're the favorite date every girl wants. Yeah, I I, I, I love a good romantic movie. Yes, I got I got to admit. Um. So uh, we had uh, someone who discovered that their French Canadian ancestor was really Spanish. That was pretty oh, good. I remember that. That was a cool one. About yeah. The last name. That was cool. Yeah. There, uh, one was about uh, whether their wife was related to themselves. And we we're talking about endogamy. Um, a lot of people said that their biggest, um, biggest thing was collaboration um, there was a story about uh, somebody who had never been able to find a, a, a grave plot. They found somebody who worked at or volunteered for a cemetery, and, and they actually went out and found the gra area where the grave was and did a great description of it. So more collaboration. Collaboration was the biggest theme in the, the question of the week. Um, let's see. Uh, found... I can't even read my own writing. Um, <laughs> oh, somebody discovered that their great, 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 or grandfather was a rum runner, uh, which was a family lore, but they actually found the newspaper article about them oh. being arrested. That he was a rum runner, but not a very good one. Uh, <laughs> he got caught. Uh, a lot of people were talking about how they were related to royalty. And there was one there was one theme or thread that went through about people who found um, brick wall busting information by searching their collateral lines, not their main family line, but but filling in all those brothers the, and sisters. The and fan cousins. chart. The fan club. Yeah, oh, sorry. Fan, fan club? Friends, associates, neighbors. Did I get that right? Am Friends. I not? Did it not pick up my right screen? Are you guys seeing question of the week? Yeah, we yeah. are. Oh, okay, good, good. We got it. Yeah. So, um, Jay uh, Polite, of course, I'm going to get it, or Palate, um, was talking about uh, finding family. So he discovered that his maternal great grandmother's brother went to the same high school as his paternal great grandfather. So you wonder how maybe people met or got to know each other. And it would never in a million years have occurred to me to look for my maternal relatives in that town. Isn't that crazy? Um, more collateral stuff there. Um, and maybe that's the takeaway from the day is don't forget your collateral lines. A lot of people add their part of their family to a tree, but we got to work on the collateral stuff, all those brothers and sisters and work. Oh, yeah. Out. Oh, yeah. True. That's really important to do. Yeah. Virginia Fields, she had a really cool story about her two times great grandfather. All of the information and records, his naturalization papers burned. Mm -hmm. And after many of your years of tracking uh, him and trying to find him, she found a brother of his that lived in New York and she was able to find out where he lived, where he was born, and she actually was able to find his naturalization papers. So Virginia, that's cool. Um, this was a, a, uh, an interesting one. David Huey, uh, Huey she, he found out that his dad was his mom's high school science teacher. Things that make you go, hmm? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, lots of people said finding WikiTree. Um, one great thing here, we have a picture with Alexis Nelson. She said because of WikiTree, she found her fourth cousin 
And it's amazing how much they are alike and how much information they've been able to share, which is really, really, really good. Um, Leanne, about that, she discovered that she liked history. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Oh, well, Palmer said Wikitree. Uh, let's see. Dorothy O'Hare down here. She had she found a wedding announcement. She didn't know she had any of these people in her family until she found a wedding announcement that listed her her grandmother's sister, her maternal aunt. So lots and lots of stuff. Tommy Buck, you're here. Find a grave. You you said that that finding find a grave was one of your biggest finds, and then it makes the people come alive. Um, then here's the French Canadian ancestor who was born in Spain. That was a cool one. Yeah. Um, and there were also the romantic stories. Where did that romantic story? Here we go. This is the. That's it. That's the Susan Alexander had the story of uh, her family. Um, her uh, Bill Thompson was toiling away, heat and humidity of Maryland, uh, stepping into his destiny. But the, the story wasn't about the Civil War. It really wasn't about cannonade, even though that was exciting. It was about the fact that Bill got shot in the leg and he was nursed back to health by Margaret. And they fell in love and they got married after the war. That was so sweet. That was probably Pip's favorite. So that was my favorite story of all of them. That was such a cool story. Yeah. So they were great. Oops. Let's stop that share. There we go. Woo! That, lots of lots and lots of great questions and answers on the question of week this week. And the takeaway, the takeaway was WikiTree is great. Collaboration. People discovered collaboration and how that can move them back. When you find somebody who knows their ancestry, they can tell you about your ancestry, mm -hmm. especially the DNA match. Oops, I just said DNA. <laughs> okay. Bye. That's it. Bye, man. Get all over with. That's it. <laughs> um, and, but the biggest thing is that I think is the takeaway for me is to work those collateral lines. Add the brothers and sisters, add their children, work yes. those lines, add the, your aunts and uncles. The fan club. Max thought I was talking about a fan chart because I didn't say fan chart, but I meant fan club. The fan families, club. the family associates, neighbors of your ancestors. Oh, absolutely. I didn't know what you were talking about. I just <laughs> I feel like going. Sarah, what are you? Like, what is she talking about? Is she really that tired? Is she just talking about it's two hours <laughs> of sleep? That's what it have is. Have another sip of your Coke. You know, when, Sarah, when I when I'm working on a, a, a particular family, I've got really good census records, say 1850, 1860, like in Paul Creek in Mecklenburg County, North Carolina. I'll look at those neighbors because you'll see family groupings that if they're not related, then. They're related in the collateral lines like Mag's talking about. And that is an important connection to make. You've got to work those other lines. If you're only working straight back, you're going to miss some really, really rich genealogy when it comes to relating to other families and stuff. And, um, and Pip would know he's from one oh, of yeah. the most monogamous areas I've <laughs> ever come across as a researcher. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and he missed that was a part of our whole before pre-conversation. Oh, that's so, true. It really is. One of one of my, I would just I feel like it's a fun discovery because it kind of blew a rumor or a you know something that the family thought, and then I discovered that wasn't so. Uh, like no. my one family line, my great grandmother would always say they were from Spain. She was from Spain. We're Spanish. And I was like, well, three generations back, you guys were all born in Guatemala. You know. Oh. <laughs> well, they, <laughs> Guatemala could have had a Spanish wow. ancestor. Well, they were they were originally from Spain, but not as, you know, she oh, wasn't Spain. she would say she was from Spain. Oh yeah. And that, you know You know it's horrible it, when you find out your grandparents <laughs> lied. Yeah, my my mom expected it, but my aunt, she was like, "What? <laughs> this is crazy." <laughs> so I think that's a 
Oh, but you know, some good. of the some of the rumors that you hear in your family, some of the stories and the lore, there's somewhere somewhere in there, there's a seed of truth, yep. and that has happened in my family. My grandfather was a yeah. great storyteller, and a lot of his stories panned out just perfectly. And some of his stories, there was they were way off, but there was just enough truth in the story to do the research and track it down. And, it, and it's worth doing the work to do that. It really is. So don't discount the stories. Because there's always something in there that just will, that might be the very thing you need to take you to further research. Well, and you know, Absolutely. speaking of the fan chart, you brought it up. The fan chart that Greg Clark created is a very good visual representation of what you're missing. It really points out the holes in your tree. Yeah. Uh, I know that's not collateral. Those are mainline people, but it's it's still great. Hmm. Tommy was just suggesting that we need a new app that lists ancestors, siblings, and spouses. If they're in WikiTree, that would be great. Mm -hmm. But if people haven't been working those collateral, yeah. but that so that one that we do have that one app that shows you that yeah, it has uh, we've shown we've shown it before. Will it be like it has a column for siblings and you can see that maybe they have no siblings listed and you could be like, well, maybe they do have siblings or spouses yeah, and children. So that app that we kind of already have kind of can at least have you start like be like, well, highly unlikely during that time period that he was an only child or something. Right, right. Yeah. That's so. true. But maybe maybe somebody can come up with something to uh, find those the ancestor sibling and spouses to kind of web web out. That's that's why I wish WikiTree had some of the uh, features that my uh, family tree da uh, database has. That can do reports and can do um, um, uh, trees that have siblings listed. You know, in a chart, uh, descendancy chart. Those kinds of things would uh, really help a lot. I wasn't maybe. talking about. Maybe down the That's cool though. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe maybe you can get well like Chris was saying to get Greg on it. What are you looking for, Mag? That's not the app I was talking about. I was looking to see if there was anything about um there's orphan profiles. I mean, if you want to find people that looks This is a cool app. This is where I found out I need to do some further research when I would use this app. What's the make sure WikiTree ID has been entered at the top? The select a number from one to 20. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Thank you. There you go. <laughs> well, no orphans in that family. Anyway, I was just looking to see. Sorry. I'll stop. Yeah, talking. Jamie Nelson has the missing links app. That's what. That's what, yeah, that's it. Missing links. And Tommy was like, how do we find that, Azure? <laughs> is on it on the app? Is it on the or, app? Or is it, well, let's look at this. Let's see if, is it on the family tree tools? That like the other stuff is. Do, 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 do. So there's a fan chart. Missing. It's not there. Missing but. links is what it's called. And it's at help app. Um, hold on a second. I just want, I just want to show you guys. Oh. Here we go. I found it. All right. Okay. Here we go. Mags will share her screen. I, as soon as I get logged in. <laughs> <laughs> um, in one job. I was logged in, but it said I wasn't, so I had to log in again. Oh, let's go there. The tunnel from hell. The tunnel yeah. of death. Oh god. Give, yeah. me, give me a wiki tree ID. Any ID. Come on. Um, let's do let's do Oroville. Oh, good one. So right three. Not so sorry. Obviously, Orville is his first name. <laughs> <laughs> and how many steps? Um, let's not do too many. Let's do five so it doesn't work too hard. There we go. Let's see what happens. What? You think my computer's not fast? Look well, at it just, go. It just, well, the more steps it is, the longer it takes to get WikiTree's stuff. 
Hello, Paulette from oh, Washington. Oh, oh, excuse me. Washington, the state, I am assuming. Yeah, that's my aunt. Oh, hey, Paulette. Hello. really? How Hello. cool. Azure's aunt. That's cool. <laughs> aunt. It's still working. I guess working. it was too many steps still. 140 people so far. How many people are in five steps there? Like 300, 500, 300 to 500? That's too much math for the morning. It's a math that don't ask Sarah to math. No math. So I don't math in the morning. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, while that is working. Big more dot code. Oh, there, there we there go. Is. Find missing links. We need to add that to the tools page. Yeah. yeah that'd be a good thing to add. I can. Yeah. Yeah, Jamie. Jamie. <laughs> hey, Newfoundland, Canada. We got a Newfie in the house. <laughs> Let's see. So here is all of the information. Showing all the privacy information, all of these profiles are and open. Look, all those people don't have children. Wow. Wow. So yeah. this would be a great, this would be the perfect app for what we were talking about. Yeah, mm -hmm. for doing At least to get, it, to get yourself started. Be like, well, Wilbur Wright, maybe he didn't have children. Maybe he did. Well, we can find out. Let's go to that profile real quick and look at it. No, that didn't take me to the profile. It just took me to the rights. I think it's because it was the privacy. No, like the, no the privacy is good. Open. Oh, is that his brother? Here we go. There you Here's go. There it free is. ID over here. Yep. <clears throat> so, oh, it yeah, the the all, so it does show all. So it does show the siblings and everything already on that app. So that would be a good. Yeah, that's a good tool to use. It sure is. A great tool. And great look, he doesn't picture. have a spouse or children. But his biography, and that's Wilbur. Did he have a spouse or children? That's his, that's the, the and you know, that's the main guy with, uh, with, with the brothers. Yeah. The, as in the Wright brothers. The Wright brothers. They were oh, right we, all along. Got, we, somebody needs to get some work done on this guy. Get him connected. Yeah. Maybe he didn't actually, maybe we just haven't marked that he didn't have a spouse or. Um, oh, I try to remember to do that on, or on profiles that I know that that's true. So it doesn't yeah. leave those, those phrases. He died up there. in 1912. Oh, so really? He didn't have a very long life, but you would think that he still huh. might have been able to get married. And How old was he when he died? Oh, uh, let's I see. I told you no mathing in the morning. No mathing in the morning. He was born in 1860. 33, 40, 45. 45. Yeah, 45. Thank, you, thank you, Wikipedia. He had plenty of time to uh, he had have plenty of time to have children. He was just designing air aircraft and, you know. It's not the kind of thing you talk about on a date, right? No, no. no unlike Pip, who goes to rom coms with all of his dates. <laughs> Uh, who, who that? So that's Charlotte Shockey. I wish there is. Oh, that's who I thought it was. Look at that. That's cool. They're watching her over her shoulder. I got this feeling somebody's watching. Okay. I'm going to stop sharing and go back to Medellin. I was trying to see if Wikipedia had an answer if he was married or not. Because his bio doesn't say anything on Wikitree. He, he died of typhoid. Oh, uh, in 1912, my grand great-grandfather died in uh, 1911 from typhoid. Hmm. It's 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 interesting. I, I, every time somebody says somebody died of typhoid, I, I find out it's right around the same time that my grand great grandfather died. So I, I just think that's a an interesting. Well, Orville didn't have a spouse or kids either, so neither of them married or had kids. I guess. Not too busy in the shop. They were too busy. They, they were, were too busy making money. money. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They didn't have time for for women. 
Hey, Jackie. <laughs> He lived forever. He lived to be 70, he lived 70, 77 years old. That's a, uh, that's enough play. So Jackie basically just, so she says, neither brother married Wilbur once quipped that he did not have time for both a wife and an airplane. Nice. <laughs> oh, well, there you Thank go. You, Jackie from Maine. Thank you, Jackie. Thank you for, so why don't we go ahead, go to Wilbur's profile and just mark his stuff that he didn't have. He didn't have any more children. I, no. I like that. No I like that. Because then it just makes the profile look better. I also like no more. Yeah. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> Alexa, then, turn out all the lights. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> and then just so everybody, if who people who don't know, if you, you can... Mark a spouse as no spouse when you go to add spouse. Yeah, that's right. And you go to yeah. click the unmarried, unmarried button here. And so once we do that, look how beautiful it looks now. There's no mm -hmm. yeah. middle name. Does he have a, a lot cleaner? Name? Maybe he didn't have a middle name because Orville didn't have a middle name. None of them had a middle name. So I can safely assume, but I'm not going to mark it because I'm not 100%. You know what happens when you assume? Yep. <laughs> you and me. <laughs> okay. So we already found out a whole bunch of stuff about Orville and his brother. Um, they didn't have time for a wife and an airplane. <laughs> um, so his birthday was August 19th, which also coincides with aviation. Aviation day? What is it? So, AV... What day was that? It was uh, aviation plane day, aviation day. August 19th also is like a day for aviation. Like it's a national aviation day because of Orville's birthday. We believe you, Sarah. You, you can click him as having no middle. Oh yeah, I got that because neither of the brothers had middle names. None of the mm -hmm. children in that family had yeah. middle names. Yeah, that's why them. I was <laughs> assuming that. I just I just can't think of the I think it's is it aviation day. Now I have to look aviation day. I think it is aviation. Yeah, avi oh. National Aviation Day, August nineteenth. So, which coincides with Orville's birthday, obviously done on purpose. Um, so we also posted a whole bunch of on G two G other famous aviators mm -hmm. who you can see if you're connected to. Like Amelia Earhart, uh, Louis Belroyt, Charles Rolls, Billy Bishop, Jim Mollison, <clears throat> the Red Baron Manfred Von Rich Richthofen. Rick Tobin. Rick Tobin. The Red Tobin. Baron. Apparently he was shot down. Look at that. Right, so, go, so you can go in, look at this, and see how you're related to everybody. Um, how am I connected to this guy? Let's see if I'm connected. I'm just going to go off. With the new change to connected finder. What? Let's see. Bingo. Wow. I'm related. Oh, I'm, not, I'm not related, but yeah, I am. I'm actually seventh cousins to Amelia Earhart. Oh, look, they're actually all at the bottom. All of the aviators are actually at the bottom of the profile, if you guys didn't already know that. Because of the update with the connection finder. Yeah, the change with the oh. connection finder. <laughs> so it was a it was a it was a Lesh who um was working on this a lot to so adding more Wow. Some technical stuff so we can have more connection points so you can see well, like we added a whole bunch of aviators so you can see all your connections to aviators. You see down there on the list it says 16 degrees from Azure. What? Who is this? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Look, Azure is like directly connected to Orville. Well, do, uh, do a relationship. Yeah, he's a... Uh... Hold on. Six cousin, four times removed. 
Wait, no. Oh, there it is. My ninth six, cousin. Six, it seven, is. Six, oh, look at that. Woo. And Azure, why why was Azure at the bottom? Because she is the member of the week this week. That's right. <laughs> hey, Azure. Azure. Azure's been doing a lot of stuff. Fun stuff. As Fun a stuff. yeah, she she's in the she's a greeter, like Pip. Um, she's a mentor, she's a ranger, she's she's been really driving the ambassador she's like sarah you know you have to get on this social media stuff you're slacking i'm like i know i know like, no. <laughs> crack the whip it's like you guys, just, you guys think she's just this soft gentle demure little girl just <laughs> sitting here quietly in her leather chair drinking she coffee. makes me tremble no i'm just kidding <laughs> Oh, you know, the greeter, greeters wouldn't survive without a lot of great people. And Azure, Azure's one of them, I tell you. She, when I've had a question, she seems to be the one who's always quick to get back to me when I'm doing my greeting duties and stuff. So yeah. I appreciate that. Pip, you've been a greeter since the beginning of time. <laughs> no, I, <laughs> there are a bunch of greeters who've been there longer than me. I, I, I think I became a greeter in the late summer or fall of uh, 2018. So almost about two years. I guess it just seems like you've been around forever. <laughs> <laughs> Since the beginning of time. It's, it feels like it. I wish I'd have gotten on earlier than I did. So, okay. So Karen, so, just, so Karen just said none of the right brother, none of the right children had middle names. Instead, their father tried hard to give them distinctive first names. So like Oracle Wilbur. And that's a quote. I'm gonna guess from Wikipedia. I would I would I would safely assume that. She didn't cite her her quote. You, how I it, dare I think, I, think, I think it's Wikipedia. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> okay. So that is our profile of the week. And so Karen's see how you're connected to him. Wait, what? Who's a greeter? Mindy. Oh, yes, oh, Mindy. Yeah, Mindy's, 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 oh. Mindy's, Mindy's another fabulous. Goodness, right? And David. Another David's fabulous. the greeter. He's in here in the chat. Yeah. David's I one of the greeter. David. How am, I, yeah. how am I connected to Azure? I'm a I'm greeter not emeritus. Azure. <laughs> I am. Aaron, I am so nice. Well, we got to work on that. <laughs> Karen is a good genealogist. Now what? A citation <laughs> on the internet? <laughs> That's funny. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. That's great. So were you going to tell us about Orville? <laughs> I mean, I feel like we said so much about his, like, I can talk. Damn. We can talk. So apparently they started doing bicycles, um, him and his brother. And they also had a newspaper. Mm -hmm. um, yep. they, just, they just did a whole bunch of stuff. And then they ventured, they started designing kites and gliders. And then that segued into, um, you know, airplanes. And apparently they found when they were doing the gliders, making an adjustable tail would make handling easier and prevent crashing. So they were definitely, I mean, they, I mean, they're the Wright brothers. They were right in creating a plane. But I'm <laughs> Bad jokes this morning. I'm here all week. Okay. <laughs> Sorry guys. Oh God. <laughs> Need some sleep, girl. You need some <laughs> yeah, sleep. Bad. It's bad. Oh. <laughs> so, so, so I guess the, here's the so Orville apparently stopped speaking to his one sister after she got married um, because he didn't approve of her spouse. Like you got married? No, we don't do that here. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> We don't we don't do that in our family. We don't get married. <laughs> and we don't have middle names. Yep, exactly. 
So while Wilbur died of typhoid, Orville died of a fatal heart attack. It occurred while he was fixing his doorbell. Do you think it was a random experience? <laughs> I mean, oh, it's not boy. funny, but it's just a random, like sometimes finding out those random facts of like, he was fixing his doorbell and he had a heart attack. Well, the um, one right above that's it that's really interesting. His last airplane ride was piloted by Howard Hughes. He was also an airplane inventor too. Remember the, uh, the, the blue goose down in uh, Florida that never yeah. that flew one time and never flew again. Largest plane in the world. Yeah. Pretty cool. That's a good connection there. Here's a uh, Howard's profile. And Howard Howard's end was strange as well. Yeah. Oh yeah. Hmm. Look at all the romances he had. My gosh. Early oh, romances. romances. Yeah, <laughs> nobody wanted to be around him with his hair and his One of them, Catherine Hep Hepburn was one of his romances. Rita Hayworth, Janet Lee from Gone with the Wind. Joan Fontaine. Oh my gosh. Jean Harlow. Jean Harlow. Wow. Oh, what a you bachelor. Ginger Rogers. Movies, you'll see all these. That's great. That's great? He was a womanizer. No. That's a great connection, though. Think about it. All the movies that you watch on Turner Classic Movies, all of these people are in there. So you get to see all these people. Now, that's cool. Well, because he was a filmmaker, too. So he was in that crowd. Yeah, he was. Yep, yep. So he mm -hmm. was. Yeah. And, and I should not have said he was a womanizer. I, I take it back. <laughs> <laughs> too late. Recorded for post. <laughs> There's no taking it. There's no rewinding, and it's, it's going to be captioned too, Meg. So it's, it's forever. Oh, <laughs> it's forever. She's in trouble now. Out there. <laughs> okay, so that is our profile of the week and all of the tangents that involved that. All and, other and all in, and I want to point out that we we talked about a lot of collateral stuff to Orville. Yes, yeah. we did. So this is a this is the collateral live cast. But in if you use the connection finder, you, you have to go through collateral lines to use the connection finder, not the relationship finder, but the connection finder. You've got to have those collateral lines in place. And if you don't connect to somebody, it's because there's more work to be done. Yeah, you got holes in your tree. You got more work to do. So uh yeah. it's very rare that I come across another wiki tree or somebody that I that I'm not connected to somehow, some way. So adding those collateral lines will do that. Yes. yes. Okay. So there's the aviators this week because it was aviation day, national aviation. <laughs> national. So, yes, okay. Jackie, I've seen it. Jackie Edros, Erdos wants to know if we've seen the biopic on Howard Hughes with Leonardo DiCaprio and Kate Blanchett. No, I haven't seen that. 52 uh, photos is my favorite part. Yes, and it's bicycles, which is kind of fitting since the art, the Wright brothers started with bicycles. Yes. Perfect timing. Great. And there's a lot of photos. Following Look at there's 34, which is kind of funny because it's week 34 and there's 34 images. <laughs> 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 X-Files theme song. I think, I'll go add, I think I'll go add one just to throw it off. I'll go find one and add it just to throw that off. I'll, then I'll, then I'll, I'll just take it back off. <laughs> okay. Oh, my gosh. We can block him from G to G. <laughs> I'd be like, never mind. Okay, so bicycles. Well, it's bikes, so it could be motorcycle, bicycle, tricycle, whatever this thing is. What is this? Is this is a bicycle, but just with a really big front wheel? That is right? Is that kind of bicycles very, very or is, bicycle? Or is maybe they have a it has a specific name of it? A specific name. It's a great bike. Mm -hmm. Still I, see a few I of those wheels. Be able to get on it. You just have to go alley oop. It's kind of junk. Oh, they they pulled up to a stand so they could get on those things. There's still there are still a few of those around. They're not 
Yeah. I mean, there's Our, there's um, people still there's still a company that makes those will actually ride my those. Kid, high school still has the concrete or the rock. There was a rock that's out in front of my kids' high school that nobody really recognizes or does anything. People sit on it, but it was the ladies' step for them to be able to get onto a horse or a carriage. Oh, that's cool. So they would pull up in front of the school. The school's very, very oh. old and on the horse or the carriage. And you could use that step for the ladies to get into their coach or to get on. That's the cool. Yeah. Love that pick with the umbrella. Yeah, look how cute little baby so in a little carriage. Now, if there was a puppy in there, I would just be over the moon. And there you go. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. We wouldn't have to go any further. We wouldn't have to look at any other pictures because yeah. that would be the, that the, would be the picture. Oh, God. Ike. 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 Oh, uh, yeah. My kid looks happy. Look at that smile. I love He's that. He's missing a tooth. Oh, look at that Aww. one. Yes. <laughs> She's All on right. a motor motorcycle. Yeah. But what is that? Yeah, look at look at her. That's oh, awesome. I didn't think that's a regular bike. No, it says motorcycle no, in the it's, title. It is. Really? It doesn't have a year on it. The handlebars, I guess, are what's throwing me off. Yeah. Is there a year in the comment? Oh no. No. Uh, Minnesota, but this is the, the person who was born in 1934, and she looked in her twenties, so probably yeah. 50. Yeah. That's awesome. That's a great photo. Mm -hmm. Look at oh look oh, at that. Look. <laughs> oh look. Look so at that. Cute. That baby looks so happy. <laughs> <laughs> I, I love the core color coordination. That's what right? I was just gonna say. He's all in yellow and the baby's the boots, all in the pants, blue. the shirt, the helmet. And the lights <laughs> and the lights on the side. Yeah, well, yeah. That's so. That's oh, and look in the very back. You can see somebody standing back in the back, like with their arms crossed. Like, what is he doing? He better not hurt that baby. <laughs> Get that baby off that motorcycle. That's right. <laughs> that's right. Oh, look, it's a race. Yay. It's cool. Oh, see, they're holding them so they have, they'll have to put their feet on the ground. They're holding them up so they so just they start just without having to push off. Yeah. That's awesome. Got the names at the bottom too. Yeah. Have beat Vic. Five cycling Jack. sons. They're all they're all brothers. Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's a that's a cool photo, like the angle. He was a, uh, was a racer. Awesome. Well, you know, there are the the tracks for speed racing. So those tracks are very elevated. Yeah, um, they sure are. Super elevation. So I bet that that is a picture of a guy riding in one of those. That's not a bicycle. I no. think it, in, in the G2G, it talks about, if she explains, or they explain about um, how he used to, he rode his bike from one place to another. So she's just talking, she uses this picture to say this is who it is. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much, Azure, for giving oh, us a play, a play on that. Oh, oh, look at that. Yeah. There's a cat. Ah. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. That's it. I'm done. That's like the epitome of cat. Like that is just explains what when you have a pet cat, that is what happens. I and I'm that goes with the dictionary. To see your black boa in your lap any second. Oh, you <laughs> remember how how hard, how terrible it hurt to ride a bike when your bare feet, because the pedals would <laughs> at the bottom of your feet. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. I imagine how much it hurts with the claws under his. Oh back. yeah, right. <laughs> Right, boy. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, Douglas is a schoolboy with his bike. In that's cool. That's cute. Mm hmm Yeah, my boa, she's over there. I got her this holes my sister's, and it attaches to the window so she can be high up and look out the window. So that's her new favorite spot now. Not your lap. Oh, look at this. That's a great one. Jennifer. Uh, the wiki treer. 
Yay. Oh, that's great. Nice. Riding a bicycle in sand is not easy. Mm -hmm. I would not wish that upon anyone. Oh, no. Look at that. Look, he's smoking his cigarette. Oh, yeah. Go yeah, smoke while like you get the time. Oh, it's a motorcycle. That's a good photo. That's like like right. in the, in the scene. Oh, so cool. cute. Mom with bike. I love that. Oh. 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 Doesn't have long enough legs yet. What's that one titled? <laughs> Me and my grandpa. And my grandpa. Pop. Oh, that's great. That's cute. First bike at Christmas, 1957. Nice. That's, that's a cute one. In Canada. Oh, Canada. Like summertime. Her sp look like they're... Bathing suits? Yeah. Like they're about to go swimming. Oh, yeah. They've been swimming in the background. And there's a bunch of people oh. up in that tree, too. Did you see That's that? That's so cute. Oh, they were behind. Yeah. And this one is cute. Like she's just like on her tricycle, on her trike. <laughs> Who calls it? Is trike like a slang word for tricycle? I would assume so. I've never heard that word before. Is she yeah. holding an ice cream cone? Yep. Oh, yeah, she is. That's why she's so happy. Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> My trike. She's styling. My yeah. grandfather. Oh, I'll wait. Oh, I like that cool. one. That's this awesome. looks colorized, obviously, because 1900. Yeah. That's a cool photo. That's his father. Hugh Burley. Mm hmm. Did from Ontario. Good, did a good job with the colorization on that one. I yeah. I know Mags has mixed feelings about that. No. This is a cool I mean, one though. Look. They're all like Gary Alabama. Thank you, cool. <laughs> We're cool on our bikes. More motorcycles. Boy, that's, he's got Harley a... Harley Davidson. Hummer. People would love to have that right now. Oh, you're not kidding. A Vespa. Is that a police officer? Um, or is just a helmet? That, that's an older version of the guy that wears all gold. See, it's the same helmet. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> you need to go to sleep, Mags. <laughs> I think I am asleep. That's cute. Like on a bike boat for three. Mm -hmm. those, are, those, are, those are a lot of fun. The girls, yeah. yeah. Have you been riding those a lot, Azure? Have you ridden one? Would, yeah, we used to go to the beach a lot when I lived in Washington. <laughs> His bike's a little small for him. <laughs> and look, there's a dog. Oh, there's a doggy. And the baby's just like, oh, face plant. <laughs> <laughs> and then the other one's just like, get off my tricycle. Yeah, really. It's too big for that. Too big, and yeah. the dog's just looking at them like, so everybody's just looking at each other. <laughs> and he's in his Sunday best, but he doesn't have any shoes on. Yeah, uh, he stole the show. Yeah, that's why the baby's like this. And then there's a lot of judgmental <laughs> going on in this photo. People are <laughs> judging him. Yeah. <laughs> and the dog's judging the girl. Dog's judging them too. <laughs> the dog looks like he's scratching a flea. Maybe. There's lots like, going on in this picture. Yeah, there <laughs> I is. I just love that that. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's interesting. A sail bike. Hmm. 
that's fun. That's you'd have to have a big wide open area to be able to. Oh yeah. To ride that. Mm -hmm. Good morning, Janine Lee Eastman Goodson. That's a cute photo. It looks like He's proud. Posing. Looks right proud. Oh, the guy! The the guy is actually in. The yeah, park. he's in it, and he the, the dog son. He's like, Dad, what you doing? You're too big. <laughs> uh, that's don't funny. don't put a dent in my car, Dad. <laughs> and that was the last one. When, Those were when good we were photos. kids. Right. When we were kids, my grandfather took a, a tricycle and, and mo put an electric battery on it and motorized it. And my brother and sister and I would ride around. They had these grass trails all around their, their backyard. And it was a big backyard. And we would around on that tricycle in that yard for forever. And we would fight over it. Oh, my gosh. We'd fight over who could ride it next and stuff like that. But I don't think there's any pictures of it. Hmm. 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 Well, that was fun. That was Did anybody fun. see health? See what? Did anybody see Hillary? Uh, also a greeter. Was on um, Monday with Mert. Oh, oh yeah, about that's right. The, and she was explaining that. Yes. The WikiTree ABC. Hillary does some really in the cool chat. She yeah. does some really cool stuff. Yep, she's a blogger. Yep, and she's got she's developing some apps. I think uh, K Knight is uh, working on some um, uh, um, programs that uh, will help you find uh, unsourced people. That uh, especially with the source line coming up, k has been working on some stuff too. Hey, yeah, Steven. they're they're in here. They're watching. Mm -hmm. Hello, yeah, Stephen. They talked about it in the weekend chat on GDG, so it's really yeah, cool. Yeah, There's a, all the links and everything are in there. Yeah. Nice. The blueberry pie for Mag. She didn't come by the chat this weekend. I had some apple pie for breakfast. I actually I did know. come by the chat. I just didn't post. I read the I, chat. I didn't post. I did have. Well, I, I did have. A few days ago, a lemon pie with blueberries smothered on top. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. And so last night, I had nice. blueberry, <laughs> black raspberry cobbler that my wife made. Yum. Yeah. Wow. If you didn't have the blackberry, then there would be perfect. Exploded. It's all keto. It's all keto, so not a lot of, not a lot of carbs. A lot of calories, yes, but not a lot of carbs. A lot of calories, but not a lot of carbs. <laughs> That's right. We just, we just burn the calories off. Can't burn the carbs off. They just stay. Anyway, I have lost uh, about 14 pounds <laughs> diet. So whatever diet my, my wife goes on, I go on too. So. Well, it's easy when you're you're the cook, right? Yes. Everybody's on don't, the don't really have a, don't really have a choice because... <laughs> <laughs> Ron, Ron is a greeter too. Hillary, I'm on my way. Blueberry muffins oh, yeah, from Ron Hillary. Does. Oh my gosh. Just like once, once they lift the travel <laughs> restrictions, I'll come. There, there you go. There might not well, be any more blueberry muffins left. She'll have to make a new batch. There we are. We're all meeting in North Wales. Yes. <laughs> We're going to Hillary's house. Or oh, Hillary is one of those people that every time I see her, even before we say anything, she just makes me smile because she is such a bubbly, bright, oh, she is. happy person. She is. Just a, I'm you not know. saying that just because you're making blueberry muffins. <laughs> just just saying. Yeah, yeah, right, right. <laughs> oh, God, we've got you figured out, Mags. Yeah. You know what, Mags? At Roots Tech, you need to just bring a blueberry pie now. That's You have to. I can't fly with a blueberry pie, but, but. Julie Ricketts, we have talked about going somewhere in Salt Lake City to get. Oh yes, we pie were. I, then, I was, then I was searching for a pie place. And, but this. Oh God. But 
Uh, yeah, next time we are at physically at a Roots Tech, we will go and look for blueberry pie. There you go. Hillary says there's only two muffins left. <gasps> um. <laughs> I can't we'll swim make it in time. Mindy's, Mindy's closer, so Mindy has to make something blueberry. She's so I have to ride a, bike, ride a bike to Newfoundland, then catch an Orville Wright airplane <laughs> and fly to Wales. There you go. <laughs> Get on, a, get on one of those biplanes. <sighs> okay. Lots well, this of fun. has this has been fun. Yes, yes. It's been great. Thank you, Pip, for coming on. Sure. Thank you for inviting yes. me. This is yeah. fabulous. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Because well, I basically declared it last time. I was like, Pip's going to come on. I know. <laughs> I have a choice. But thank you. That was. It's been wonderful. <laughs> well, yeah, especially talking to Mags. Dude, let me point the right way here. Point the mag. <laughs> I'll get it. There he is. Talking about Lincoln County, Tryon County. Yep. And dogging me in Tryon yeah. County. Oh, gosh. Oh. It's hard to dig. I'll do it reverse. I know. Azure, Opposite. Era. <laughs> the Scarecrow and Wizard of Oz. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Well, I got to go too, so I got, I got a trip yeah. to make. Yeah. So, because I did, yeah, I just Pip, gonna leave. So, Pip, I yes. wanted to mention before I'm everybody goes, profile, and I'm gonna look up and see if you are a DNA match to my my friend that we were talking about earlier, the Cashins. Oh yeah, I don't know if I am or not, but you can check and see though. Maybe right. maybe. Uh, maybe through that uh, baby line, you can check it out and see. Okay. I just uploaded my Mito to uh, my, to uh, Mito Y DNA. I've got two now, so yay! Two for all of you when I did it. Well, I hope so. Yeah. I mean, well, she is. She is. Uh, I've added it to WikiTree too, and uh, it was an FT DNA Mito, and uh, I do see that you are T one three two one three. That's me. Well, that's easy to remember. T one three two one three. Yeah, mm -hmm. I got two kits there now. One's the one's the Y, and one's the, the Mito. So there you go. Yeah, cool. And I'll figure out how to use the site, and I'll be all right. Oh, <laughs> it's easy. And if you need help, extra help, give me a shout. Okay, yeah. I will. <laughs> I'll do that. I gotta hit the trail because I got a I got another appointment, so I'm gonna go. Bye. Okay. We're probably Bye, gonna all head out. Bye, Bye Tim. All you. Thank Bye you everybody. all of you. I'm here. Thank you all of Bye you who commented. Well, I guess we'll, all, we'll say goodbye to everybody.